Joe Staley, who was injured earlier, is out. Toss to Frank Gore. Turns the corner. Good run by Gore. Up to the 47. It's a first down. Tim Agoa-Togway with a tackle, but a good one by Frank Gore. And he just loved the misdirection. And Mike Johnson has called a good game today, the offensive coordinator of the 49ers. And they, they, they just haven't looked like the same offense that they did for the first eight games. Troy Smith has certainly brought an effectiveness to the outside the pocket play, Sam, the edge plays. Frank Gore has gotten the support that he needed today. So far, he has total yards from the scrimmage over 130 yards. Toss to Gore again. They like that play. They work it again. It's just a stiff arm on James Hall. And gets into Rams territory down to the 48-yard line. Frank Gore has run for 72 yards, 19 carries, 72 yards. One touchdown run. His long run of the game, 23 yards. Here's the beauty, though, of the support he's getting from Troy Smith. Right now is when you want your running back to be as fresh as he can be. Frank Gore's, I believe, fresh because of what Troy's able to do in the passing game. Frank's coming off a career high last game against Denver, 29 carries. Two tight ends to the left side. Vernon Davis and Delaney Walker. Walker motions. Here's Gore. Behind Moran Norris, the fullback. Gets down inside the 45-yard line. James Hall made the tackle. He'll bring up a third and short for the 49ers. And I like the, excuse me, Sam, I like the perimeter play calling, and I'll tell you what it does in the run game. Is number one, you're getting the ball to Frank. Number two, you're gassing those defensive ends. You're getting those guys breathing hard, which if you can get them breathing and sucking wind, it's the ultimate equalizer to the pass rush. Tony Lockheed has done a good job at left tackle replacing the injured Joe Staley. And that guy right there has been out of his head, Chris Long, in terms of rushing the passer today. He's been superb. Here's something that has hurt the 49ers. They call a timeout. Third down They're conversions have really hurt them in this game. They are 0 for 11. Troy Smith, who was picked up on waivers of, after the final cut down after training camp from the Baltimore Ravens is the man who's now a quarterback. We welcome those of you who watched the Dallas Cowboys defeat the New York Giants at the Meadowlands 33 to 20. Thanks for joining us. We are in overtime, tied at 20. Yeah, and here's the first touchdown by Frank Gore, who was set up by a long pass to Josh Morgan. Frank punches that one in. Watch Danny Amendola just find a little soft spot in the zone for the Rams. Touchdown. St. Louis, terrific throw. Now Steven Jackson is going to break a tackle from Deshaun Goldson. He's going to punch that one in and then Crabtree. And just a great play by Troy Smith. Buying time, buying time. Delivers a ball. Crabtree comes down with it. Pretty big touchdown. We've got a matchup of Heisman winning quarterbacks and both have played great. Sam Bradford and Troy Smith. Smith in trouble. He was going down throws and it's incomplete. And there's a flag on the play. They're getting P.I. on O.J. Otagway. Oh, boy. That is going to put the 49ers in field goal range. Pass interference against Delaney Walker. Now you see the back judge there talking number 21. Pass interference, defense number 21. The ball is placed at the spot of the foul. Oh, boy. First down. Troy Smith extending the play, and here it is right there. Ball's in the air. Delaney Walker stops, tries to get back to it. Otagwe run, runs right into him, and Don Carey, the back judge, saw it through the flag. But I'm telling you, Troy Smith extending that play, and it looked like they had him sacked. And who, his 225 pounds and his body strength came in handy right there as he able to stay up and deliver the football and pick up a big-time penalty. They are well within the range of field goal kicker Joe Nedney at the 23. Gore and Norris in the backfield. Frank Gore. Let's move. Good run by Frank Gore down in the 17. Even, even better position now for the 49ers. So penalties, we talk about penalties hurting the 49ers, but 12 penalties on the Rams have taken their toll, and that pass interference penalty, a huge one. When would you try the field goal? I would just get, I would not put anything up in the air and get myself positioned for where Joe Denny wants it in terms of the hash mark. Walker motions, take it on third down. Gore cuts it back. And he's got it up for the first down, down to the 12 yard line. Kick it, just kick it. And here comes Joe Nending. He has had 19 game winning field goals in his career.
sense of a coach whose team has not been able to win on the road this season. For Mike Singletary, a nervous moment. His team needs a win to keep their hopes alive. This will be from 29 yards out. Andy Lee, the holder. And the kick is right through. The 49ers win.